Hello everyone, welcome back. I promised another video yesterday, so you know, you gotta keep your promises, right? So I'm back. So what we're gonna do today is we are going to make emerald green slime. And as you know, yesterday I made ruby red slime. So this is part of a new series called Precious Colors and Precious Gems. So, what is that? Dust. <laughs> Alright, so let's get into the video. So, I am going to um, switch to my webcam so we can start getting ready. So, first but, but first but foremost, we need to see our ingredients. Elmer's glue. Clear glue. Elmer's activator. Clear activator. Green food dye. Mixer. I mean, whisk. A bowl. And all of this is in a tray. So I'm going to get to the uh, webcam part now. So uh, w start watching my video. Follow along if you want to follow along my slime. See you on the webcam to make our slime. Moving on to section one. Adding glue and color. Hello. So our first step is we first need to put some of our glow and in glue into our bowl. Unscrew to bottoms up. Oh, that's gonna make some good slime. Unscrew, I mean screwed back on. Alright, so our next step is we're supposed to add color to make our slime. So uh Let's add the color, open it up, drip it in. This is going to be some emerald green. Alright, so now we uh, go on to step two, which is adding activator and mixing. Alright everyone, so our next step, we need to add some magical liquid or activator. Add quite a bit. The slime needs to be slime, not something else. Screw it back on. Set it aside. Bring out our whip, whip out our mixer and start mixing. Right. You can stand if you need to. Kind of a little grippy. It's really watery. Maybe I should have used less activator. Come on, Mac. Why'd you turn off? Oh, okay. Sorry. The Mac just goes into screensaver once every two minutes, so uh, I just had to um, turn it back on because it went into its annoying screensaver. You gotta mix a lot with this stuff. That is slimy. Ooh. 
One lesson for you guys to learn on making slime. Do not use too much activator. And one safety tip for you guys when making slime. This is very important, so please be sure to listen. Do not use borax in your slime. Borax is poisonous. It is such a dangerous chemical. I don't know why people even use it for slime. So I recommend you refrain from using, uh, what's it called, borax in your slime just for your own safety. And I actually heard that uh, borax can it's not really good for your skin, so please stay away from it. Especially if you have allergies, one thing. And I got the slime all stuck in the mixer. Oof. All right, everyone. So that's about it for adding activator. For I mean, for a, for adding activator and mixing. So now we're going to move on to the ending. Switching in three, two. Okay, cancel that countdown. Switching cameras in three, two, one. Hello everyone, welcome back. I hope you liked that video. Uh, well, the slime turned out to be okay. It, it is a passing grade for slime. I'd give it a 98% of a grade for the slime. And the reason I'm giving that grade is because um, the slime, what like really was like broken into pieces versus the ruby red slime that we did yesterday turned out to be, uh, it, it just turned out to be like a big lop. Like you just have to like stretch it apart. So the, the today's slime is like really watery and stuff, but it turned out to be good. I was able to mix it that well so the activator dissolves in it and stuff. So uh, one thing I have to say before I go is to stay safe, of course. I heard there's another storm heading for, I think, the mid-USA. mid, mid, mid USA. And uh, if, any of you, uh, if any of you fans of mine were involved in the deep freeze in Texas, I hope that you guys are recovering and I hope that nothing bad happened to you guys. And, uh, one thing, one other thing that I would like to say, as you know, if, if you visit my website lately, uh, you can see the section on my news that on April 3rd, our editor, you know, ASABC editor will no longer be our editor. And I will be editing our videos full time, but my mom, which is the editor, will still be featured in my videos, but not as much as before. So if you guys like the editor, hashtag love the editor in the comments. And if if you comment that first, I will ping your comment and give it a heart and a like. That's what I like to do here. And whoever comments, I will heart your comment, of course. Unless if people are saying that I am wasting stuff, which I am not. I already explained that in my other video. So thank you guys for watching. Have a great day. And uh, we will be doing some shout outs in the end and the very ending credits part of this video. So thank you for watching. You may be in the shout outs. Thank you for watching. Let's get to the shout outs. Three, two, one. Cue the shout outs, editor.